Attack number 26 to the Atlanta Falcons. Now we see you holding the picture of your grandmother here. What was it about her that helped you lead you to this point? Her spirit, man. I mean, she, she never gave up. I mean, she always preached never give up. And for me, I had plenty of opportunities in life to give up on football, to give up on life, to give up and just, you know, go to the streets, gangs, et cetera, et cetera. But like I said, her just preaching never give up was the biggest thing in my life. And I, I like to take that on the field with me when I play football. Never give up. I mean, just run to the ball. If quarterback scrambling, scramble with him. I mean, you never know what can happen. If, a, if it's a screen pass, run to the ball. I mean, you just never know what can happen. So just never give up on the play. And like I said, my grandma, she, like I said, she was everything to me. We saw how tenacious that defensive line with the Falcons was that led them to an appearance in the Super Bowl. Yes, what do you think you add to the fray? Um, like I said, it's, it's hard to rush every play as a D line man. I mean, it's, it's, it's hard to do. Like I said, linebackers can stay on the field as long as possible, but D line is hard to do. So the Falcons, they got great pass rushers, Vic Beasley and Dwight Freeney. And like I said, Vic led to, you know, the, the NFL and, and sacks. I mean, Dwight Freeney is a Hall of Famer. So if I could just go in and just learn from them guys and like I said, whenever they is tired and just, you know, give them a break, but continue to pass rush out there. Like I said, I'm just all about winning. We certainly wish you the best of luck, Tack. Congratulations. Yes, sir. Thank you. Go Falcons.